Blackstone Valley Tech School in Upton getting ready to celebrate its 50th anniversary. Superintendent Dr. Mike Fitzpatrick has been in charge for the past 22 years. He told WMRC the nursing program initiated a few years ago is going well. Yes, thank you. We have a new director. Uh, The previous director announced her retirement, moving into another position, uh, and and being able to spend a little more time uh, at home and things like that, which we recognize. Uh, The new director has jumped into her role. Uh, and the program continues to be particularly popular. Uh, and to the best of my knowledge, all the graduates have successfully passed the exam uh, and also have gained employment. This is a great way to help the area uh, in multiple forms. Projects over the summer, you saved the district about $322,000 by helping them out. We try. Uh, as you have pointed out in the past and we've uh, looked at uh, over the shows, we do five to 600 projects a year, uh, some, some larger than others. And uh, it's a great way for our students to expand their classroom, to do things for their home communities, uh, to add to the competencies, and even the opportunity to apply their academic lessons mm-hmm. in, in various settings and save our communities money. The science labs up and running, you got some state grant money for this? Yes, the science labs are part of our STEM uh, effort, although arts is still part of that as a subcomponent. Uh, but the, they're up and running, and you're welcome to visit anytime you want. The sophistication yeah. of the science lessons and we can see the results. I mean, the MCAS re- uh, results that were just reported for the 20th year in a, r- in a row, we sit in a very, um, you know, uh, favorable and enviable position. Valley Tech Superintendent, Dr. Mike Fitzpatrick.